Welcome back, beauties and bows. Hey, y'all, hey. Anyways, it's Bree. I'm back with the video, and this video is about the real daytime show. If any of y'all watch, I'm sure a lot of y'all watch it. But, um, yes, it's about, uh, um, it's just basically a daytime show where, um, five, is it five? Yes. Five co-hosts talk, you know. Pretty much, it's just a real life show, basically. It's five ladies, they just talk about, you know, hot topics and just, you know, drama or anything. Basically, girl talk. It be girl or, or guy talk, to be honest. Even though five girls are doing it. But anyways, um, it's featuring Miss Tamar Braxton, Lonnie Love, Tamara Mori, um, Jenny Mai, and Adrienne Balan. But yeah, so recently... Everyone has got the news about how Tamar is being left out of the show. She's basically, they're basically letting her go. And she's not going to be a part of the show anymore. We do not know why. I've waited two days to make this video, right? So, I waited two days so I can see if there's going to be a valid reason why Miss Tamar is leaving. Like, why Tamar? Why Tamar? When I first heard that, I was like, why Tamar? You know, because it's like... Tamar and all the other girls make the show. I mean, I feel like the show wouldn't be the show without all of their different personalities. Like, you know, they all have different personalities and it makes the real show. So I feel like, I don't know what it could be, what's the reason, but I'm also not going to sit here and, how can I say this? Okay, I've recently seen a girl make a video and she was crying bawling crying like about this situation how Tamar's not going to be on the show anymore and how she lost her job i'm like i don't know all i got from that was just like i'm not gonna sit here and cry about the situation i'm sad because it's like it's like oh my gosh i like to i love tamar and she makes the show along with the other girls and who's going to replace her who's going to be like tamar but then again it's like how many different people lose jobs every day? Regular people, you know what I mean? That don't have other jobs. Miss Tamar is going to be fine. She's going to be good. She's going to live life because at the end of the day, she has her singing career. She has two other reality shows that she's on, Braxton Family Values, and her own one, which is, um, you know, Tamar and Vincent. I don't know what's the name of it, but I watch it. I think it's Tamar and Vincent show <laughs> yeah but anyways she has money like she's going to live and she even said she's going to be fine i believe she's going to be fine this could be a blessing in disguise for not only her but if they're going to replace her that person like you know you never know it's probably not for her you know maybe it's meant for her to have her own show talk show if that's what she want to do but at the end of the day things happen for a reason i'm not gonna ball and cry about it because it wants for once, it's not me, and second off, it's like, I don't know, that's just not me. I'm not gonna cry about it. I just seen, I just felt like that was really dramatic for um, this video I seen about this situation with a girl was just crying or whatever. I understand, yes, the show did do help me as a um, female, like, you know, just to vibe with other girls and see their opinions on different stuff. Yes, I love that, but at the end of the day... They got to move on. Life goes on. But, again, I'm just really, I really want to know what's going on. Like, what's tea? Why is Miss Tamar getting fired? Like, why? I don't, this is really why, too. I, like, I know I'm not the only one when I see the credits, credits rolling. I see Vincent Herbert's name, right? Am I not the only one? Like, I thought they had a lot to do with the show. Like, I thought that they brought it up. I could be wrong, but I know I see his name. I'm sure I see his name rolling up. I gotta see it again, because I thought it was up under producer. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm wrong. But it had production, something like that. I don't know. But I'm sure his name was on there. And I'm saying, and I'm only saying this because that's her husband. And maybe they knew about it. I don't know. Because people ain't about to be going out for me. But if y'all do, oh, well, maybe they knew about it. Because 
first off, y'all do remember when this kind of was brought up not too long ago. And she was like, I ain't going nowhere. I don't know where y'all getting these rumors from. Blah, 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 blah. But now it's true. Like, she's really leaving the show. Maybe she's probably pretending not to know because she don't want to go back on her word when she said she wasn't leaving. Okay, I don't know. Because if y'all come for me, let's go. What's up? Let's good. Anyways, I'm just playing. I don't care. Y'all can come for me. But anyways, yeah, out of Tay Martians. Y'all better go and get on them. Don't get on me because I ain't find her. Anyways, but yes, um, maybe it's just something else out there for her to do. Like I said, on her own TV show, maybe it's time for her to focus more on her music because that, that woman can sing. She would make me cry. I'm only 20 years old. I ain't been through nothing. No breakups. I never had a, yeah, I never had a boyfriend. I ain't want to say out there, but you know, I'm gonna be real child. But yeah, you know, I never been hurt. But she be making me feel like I was hurt. She be making me feel like I was hurt. <laughs> I be crying. Let me not take it to fall. I don't cry, but I be like, dang. When I'm listening to her music, I be like, I'm mad at somebody or I'm in love with somebody. And then I have to come back to reality and be like, wait, who? Anyways, but yeah, I just wonder why. This is really going to be a difference in the show. I'm not going to lie. She brought a lot to the show. She contributed a lot to the show. Maybe, again, maybe it's because... You know, sometimes God, God say, give you a, he give you like a, um, how can I say this? He give you several reasons. Is it a clue? I don't know. Anyways, he give you, uh, let's say clue. He give you like clues and examples. I mean, things just happen. Like say for instance, she got sick and she had to leave the show. He kind of gave, he probably was kind of giving her a little clue saying like, hey, this is probably not for you. This is taking on to your health. Because I know Tamar loves, like she always stressed about she wants to be great. And she don't, I don't know if she understands this or not, but Tamar, you do a lot. Like you are good. Like what are you doing a good? I know you want to be perfect. Sometimes I struggle with that same, you know, thing. I want to be perfect and what any, perfect and anything I do. And I sometimes stress out on it, but then I have to come back to reality. I use stuff like examples like what happened to you with your sick, how you got sick and stuff like that. And you got, you know, just so, I don't know, worked up because you do a lot. Um, so I feel like that's probably why your health took on to that level. So God is trying to basically trying to sit you down and say, hey, just sit down for a while. Take on to, you know, just do stick to um these few things that's really going good and not just you know anything you do is not supposed to make you feel stressed out you're supposed to do it because you want to do it i don't know what i'm trying to say basically you're supposed to do it because you want to do it and not get stressed out don't let it stress you out because if the thing you're doing is taking a toll in your health in your life then you're not supposed to um you're supposed to sit back and listen to God and say, I need to step back because this is really, this could be dangerous. So he did that. He sat you down for a little bit, but I guess you still didn't learn and you came back. You know, it's probably just something not for you. It's just, because I know she said she put a lot into the show and, you know, just ideas and different stuff. It's just like, it's too much for one person. So... Not saying she do it alone, but, you know, some people can't take what other people can take. You know what I mean? So, anyways, maybe it's that. And because you're doing a lot, God tried to sit you down, but you're still doing it. And, I don't know. Yeah. But, anyways, um, yes. And this can also be a blessing for the person that's coming in. If they're going to replace you. Maybe that person is really was it was really for that person and it took you it took Tamar. Why am I talking like Tamar is about to watch this? Okay. It took Tamar to be an, an example for that person to get ready for what he or she's about to do. Maybe it's gonna be a guy. You never know. That'll be cool if it was a guy. But yeah. Maybe it's gonna be um that. And that's even better. 
Tamar because she's helping. She could be helping someone else, you know. It's always good to help someone else. But yes, I want to get into the tea. What happened? I do not believe it had anything to do with the other co-hosts. I just don't. But if it did, if it is, whew, I want to know. I love tea. I want to know. But anyways, I'm not gonna make this video too long. But what I do want y'all to do is, if you're not subscribed, if you're not a beauty or a bow, then I would love for you to subscribe and you immediately become a beauty or a bow. So, in all my other beauty and bows that's already subscribed, if you will go ahead and comment below what you think, if you watch the show, if you um, know anything about the show, just, or what I said, just let me know what y'all thinking um i like to do videos like this if it's anything that y'all want me to review on let me know and thank you for watching i love y'all so much um have a great day night morning whatever whenever you're watching this thank you bye